Hey there YouTube, this is Derek at the University Blog. The blog discusses student and university issues. I want to talk to the high school students in the audience right now, or the students who just graduated high school. Um, doubtless, there was at least one teacher in your high school who would describe a university as this period of non-stop work, where you just work, 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 and ten times what you're doing right now, and it's probably got you more than a little panic. Uh, at least I was. And then you'll also remember these college movies where there's just non-stop partying and craziness. Uh, and then that's probably got you a little confused how, how, where that perception comes from. Uh, I want to clear up any confusion you might have. University has so much more work than you are used to right now. Uh, much, much, much more reading, much more uh, work in terms of assignments, things like that, and that, that probably goes for every program, but I can only speak for business and history. But, you know what? It has so much less class time than you're used to right now. So much less. I, I have one hour of class tomorrow. One. My heaviest day this week is four hours of class. Uh, and that's for the whole semester. So, it's not like you don't have the time to do it. You really do have ample time to complete all of your assignments, even if it seems like a bit of a crunch to do it sometimes. The problem is, with all that ample time, you have to motivate yourself in a way that you never had to do in high school to complete your assignments on time, or before they're due, or at least don't do them the day before they're due, if you want them to be any good. Uh, that requires a lot of discipline and a lot of motivation, and that's where I've seen most students fail. It's not because they weren't bright enough, it's not because they weren't capable, it's because they were lazy. Not because they're lazy because of the amount of work, but they were just lazy getting started. Um, uh, what one thing I've tried to do to keep up is I keep a list of every assignment, every task I have to do. Uh, and I also keep a little note when roughly I plan to do it. I give myself plenty of time because I'm a procrastinator too, uh, but I at least have this staring at me in the face all the time. Because that's another problem. You'll have a lot, a lot more on the go. You'll have to learn how to multitask when you're at university, and or just learn how to juggle assignments. And if you don't keep a record of what you have to do, you might wind up forgetting something really, really important. But you know what? You are capable of time management. You are capable of self-discipline. And after all the time management and self-discipline, getting your assignments done, you are capable of going out and having a wonderful time, uh, certainly rivaling some of those crazy college movies.